What is going on with you YouTube? This is Regular Dave coming at you with another video. Yes, I'm back on my sports tip. Starting my USC Trojans dynasty, man. I'm trying to return them to glory. They fell off a little bit, came into the season not ranked. I'm in SoCal, they're in SoCal, so I just felt like playing with them. I got two main goals this season, point blank period. There's two things I'm trying to do in this dynasty this season. One, get Marquise Lee to Heisman. Two, win a national championship. That might be hard. I'm not even ranked. We're going to see how the season goes. I know y'all going to be rocking with me. We're going to go. We're going to go with the Trojans this year. Um, and I'm going to start a dynasty, man. I'm going to build the program back. I'm going to build back what Lane Kiffin destroyed. All right, let's go. Glad to have you with us in the studio. I'm Reese Davis, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. You might think of the Hawaiian Islands as a place of tranquility. You wouldn't think that way if you have to deal with the Hawaii Warriors. They've completed their pre-game battle dance. Now the final stretch as Hawaii tries to defend its home island. Thanks for joining us here on the NCAA College Football pregame show. Now let's send it out to Brad and Kirk for all the action. We'll see you at the half. All right, man, so we going to hop right in the opening kickoff, man. Go one, make Marquise Lee the Heisman. Let's see if we can take it home on the opening kickoff. This would be a great way to start the season. I said this would be a great way to start the season. Let's take it to the house. We're going home, y'all. <laughs> hey, they was calling me to come home. I had to go to the house, man, to start off the season. How else better can you start it off? 105-yard kick return to open up the season in Hawaii, man. USC is not ranked. I'm trying to get them ranked and actually the number one and two. It's going to be a tough task because I've been playing a lot of the game. It's going to be a tough task. But when you got this dude who's all world, Marquise Lee, man, hey, it gets a little easier. Starting quarterback. They got the starting quarterback. Um, I think it's Wittek. Um, I don't think they've actually decided. They're deciding going into spring practice, but I think he's in the lead. All right, man. So we up 7-0, man. I can tell you the theme for this game is going to be pressure. What what I say? Pressure. <laughs> we get into the quarterback all game long. Point blank. Period. Yo, I replaced Lane Kiffin. I forgot to tell y'all. That's your boy, regular David Coach. You know what I mean? I, I, I suited up. I'm not going to lie. I'm in a suit every week. <laughs> y'all know how I get down. All right, man. So, it's my ball again. They had to punt. Look at that. All right. Hey, yo, this, this, this tight end is a monster of a man. Telfer, he is humongous. I don't know if this guy is that huge in real life, but good Lord. All right, man. So, we need to get Marquise Lee some balls. We'll see. Okay, pause. Hold on. We need to get him some catches. <laughs> so we'll see if we can get it done. All right. Look at that. That's that's two catches for him. I need to. The thing with the Heisman, you got to score touchdowns. Period. Point blank. No way around it. Let's see what we can do. All right. Seven zero. We in the red zone. Uh oh, man. You can't. You can't miss that tight end coming over the middle though. You can't miss that. Look how. Watch, watch how like he's built. Like he's built like a linebacker. Yo, this dude can catch. He got hands. I don't think he got speed though. All right. And he's not actually guaranteed to be the starter from what I was reading. I think there's a dude named Grimble or something like that. And they're probably going to compete for that job. Probably both get playing time. All right, man. So the Hawaii Warriors are down. They're in a hole. Uh-oh. What I tell you about that pressure? Yo, this game has an RPG element where you could, you know what I mean, add tokens to unlock certain things. Well, what I unlocked was the pressure. Uh-oh. Hey, that's the thing with... Marquise Lee, yo, when he catches that ball on the slant, he could just turn up and go. And that's what I try to do. It didn't work out in this game so much, but that's what I do. Uh-oh, don't forget. Oh, wait. Hold on. I forgot I got Silas Red. Isn't that the Penn State? The dude that said, yo, this this <laughs> this program is going down. I'm bouncing. And, and Lane Kiffin was like, yeah, hey, we'll take you. All right. Y'all can see I'm up 14-0. My drive stall, you know what I mean, five minutes into the into the second quarter, man, you it's looking like it's going to be a blowout. We'll see because, you know, my games never turn out that way. I don't care who I'm playing, the computer, real people. It don't matter. But when I play the computer, you know what I like to do is I like to blitz a lot. That's what I like to do. But then now they're trying to take advantage of me. they down in the hall, man. They don't want to be embarrassed at home. Yeah, I mean, we on that island. Um, 
Let's see. Uh oh. Look at dude bouncing outside. Yo, they were showing off that footwork. Yo, I was playing this game. I was doing things I really wasn't supposed to be doing to see how the change of direction works. And nah, it's 50 50. It's hit and miss. Now they want to hit me with the option. That is the, probably the hardest thing on this game to defend is the option, man, because your dude's just. Eh. I don't know. I don't know how to put it, but it just seems like they're always out of place. Let's see if we can stop that option. Let's see. Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. All right, man. They marching on your boy. I'm up 17. Oh, man. I want to shut them out going into the half, man. I don't want to give them any glimmer of hope. And as you can see, we got a full blitz going. We got a full blitz. I got stars on people. Dawson, middle linebacker. We coming. Here we come. All right. All right. Pressure. Yo, that, that should be. They should both get a half sack on this game. But, man, this game has a hard time interpreting assisted tackles. When you look at that stat, it's normally zeros across the board. All right, here we go. Look at that. This dude don't know what to do. Yo, that coverage was on point. He had them happy feet. <laughs> you see, he's trotting around like, oh, hey, wait, huh? What? All right, we're going to hit you in the mouth. <laughs> Period, point blank. Hold on. What do you think the story is for the game track? What story do you think they told all the sacks? I had an insane amount of sacks. A lot of them was the same guy. I think his name is Yuko. Um, yo, that game track. Look at, look, hey, look at me. I'm on this. Man, I'm telling you, I'm channeling my inner Tom Landry. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's see. Let's see what we talking about. Yo, play that D, play that D. Okay, this is getting a little out of control now. And hey, that's the one thing about college football, the disparity. But hold on. Hold on, I got a special treat for you because this is just game one. This is how we get down. Now he's flushed and they got it. His pass rushing dominance is bringing him close to the single game sack record. Well, this guy's putting on a clinic on how to be a dominant pass rusher. He's so well coached, but he also has a ton of intangibles that you just can't teach. All right, man, so I broke the single game pass record for USC in the first game of the season with a defensive tackle, which doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but that's how that game was working out. And I think it's because it's, uh-oh. Oh, your boy trying to turn it up the field on me. Um. I think it's because I allocated something to, you know what I mean, have insane pass pressure. They gave me one token to spin. I don't know how it works, man. I ain't trying to get into the RPG element. I'm trying to get on that field and make plays. All right, let's see. Oh, wait, hold on now. You know, that wasn't the pressure I wanted to. We in the second half already. I'm up 17 nothing, man. I think this is their first drive in the second half, and they moving on me. They dinked and dunked me, though. That was the thing. This is not dinking and dunking. This is just... This is just pure aggression. The running back, look at that, man. You see he got stopped and kept going? I ain't got time for that. All right. Let's get that stop, though, man. They, they at the goal line. They right where... All right, I'm not getting that stop. Yo, they back in the game. I don't need that in my life. I can't even pronounce this dude's name. Let's just call him Joey. First name, you know what I mean? Punching in the end zone. Yo, one thing we don't need is a week one upset because that throws all... I'm not even ranked to begin with. I, I, wait, they got the ball back, and now they're going for a field goal. Yo, they're trying to bring it to a one-score game. Yo, I'm not ranked to begin with. A week one loss will completely eliminate me from the national championship hopes. I can't have that. That's what I can't have. So what I need to do is score right here because it's a one-point game. Let's go. See, I, I keep running that slant because I want Lee to catch it. He got that speed and that acceleration. And when he goes, it's like, man, it's, it's like watching him run track. All right, man. Silas Red, just look at that. Reading the holes, using the change of direction. We need that. That plant and go that one step and try to get upfield. All right. Your boy's moving. Third quarter. Couple couple seconds left. Time's running out. Let's see if we can punch it in the end zone right here. Your boy's adjusting plays. Uh-oh. This dude's always falling forward. I don't care if he was a brick wall in front of him. He would fall forward. That's a beast of a man. All right. Fourth quarter. We got a score, man. No field goals. Let's punch it in this end zone, man. You know, if y'all know my past videos, y'all probably ain't watch me when I post a fit. Uh-oh, oh, uh-oh. Uh if y'all ain't know, y'all watch my past videos, I always screw it up. Hey, that was, man, I, I can't front. That was just a hell of an interception. He didn't put that ball where it was supposed to go, but that dude made a play on a ball that was unbelievable. All right, man, it's it. Fourth quarter, one, <laughs> one score game, and I'm taking the ball back. That was directly on a next drive. Man, I needed that in the worst way. Yo. This ain't going to be a pretty victory. I don't know if this game rewards you for pretty wins or blowing out USC, opponents. I'm just looking for that victory right now. I'm just looking to escape, man, and just, you know what I mean, get off this island with a victory. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We hitting the slot receiver? Is, are we hitting the slot receiver? Is that what we doing? Nelson Aguilar? I don't know that dude. I don't know half these dudes. All right. Silas, let's punch it in right quick, Silas. Uh-oh. Do it for Penn State. <laughs> All right. We getting in that end zone. Let's keep it pushing. Yo, all right, 24-10, five minutes left. I'm confident, confident in my defense. We stopped him for the rest of the game, 
Hey, I like this play. I had to show that one to you. Yeah, I mean, that, they could have gotten the end zone on that play, but look at that, man. That That's the realism that I'm talking about. He got in there and literally put his hands on the ball and knocked it out. Yo, that pretty much wrapped it up for me, man. Nothing else to be seen. Let's, let's, let's see what's going on. Final. Hey, it wasn't pretty, but it was a start. Yo, I'm on the way. First of all, Marquise Lee. Yeah, this ain't a great start to get that Heisman. This is also not a good, convincing victory to get me ranked. <laughs> but we're going to see, man. I got some fire coming for y'all in the future. Uh, yeah, man. The dynasty started, man. It's the dynasty. All right. I'll get at you guys another time. Peace.